So imagine being mistaken for one of the most hated men in Britain, subjected to a rel... You, you were, were in prison and uh, had, has absolutely... You might be this person. They were willing to take your child. Yes. Uh, and you, I mean, this is you're sort of virtually a recluse. You, mean, so you were d driven out, really, and you, uh, and you went back to, to Liverpool. Statement from the Ministry of Justice, uh, which says, we can confirm that John Venables has been recalled to custody following a breach of licence conditions. Obviously, they're not going to go into any further con uh, details. Um, uh, good luck to you. Yeah, and, uh, I hope and this I hope stops. This has, uh, I really at least do. helped to depart. I thought, thank you very much. Very good. Thank you very much. Uh, for details of helplines, have a look on our website, itv.com slash morning. Still to come, Charlotte Church, military-inspired fashion, plus Ed Baines' tasty tandoori chicken. We'll be back after the break. Drawn in, and you can see that it is all very dramatic. Um, <laughs> but I just wanted to have that time when they were really young. Yeah. Um, I just wanted to be with... Oh, she's lovely. Yeah, she is so nice. Thank you, Charlotte. Right after the break, uh, Jason Gardner's going commando with military-inspired fashion. <laughs> Not to be but later on in the meantime, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. And Sarkozy um, said thanks very much as well. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we are continuing our sex week special when uh, we meet the woman who has never had an orgasm and she's desperate for one. Right. Find I'll out be what around happened. later. It's the latest dancing on Icy Vic T. <laughs> Yes, good luck with that. Now, as you know, all this week, Philip and I are dedicating ourselves to improving the nation's sex life. It's, it's, a, tough, it's a big job, it's isn't it? It's a tough that? job, but someone's <laughs> got to do it. Uh, we want to uh, put the spark back into your relationship if you think you need one and reignite those flames of passion. It's time to sex up your life. Sex with, how much you've drunk really affects it as well. So um, it is an incredibly, it's quite frightening because it's all about pressure. If you've never had one, it's a bit like, whoa, what's happening? What's and, and the only thing you've really got to compare it to is when you're desperate to go to, go to the loo. <laughs> and, mm. and that's what stops a lot of girls. They're like, whoa, if this goes any further, I'm, I'm worried about what's going to happen. But So that's why it's um, easier. Yeah, a is lot it, easier. Uh, is it also better to stop worrying about these sort of things? Some orientated in sex. And the less we, we think about, oh, am I going to have an orgasm or not, the more... In yourself. Definitely, without a doubt. Um, <coughs> Good. Oh, <laughs> thank Danny, thank you for doing that for thank us. It's great. Thank you. Great. Well, uh, Tracy will be back after the break when she'll be giving advice on different sexual positions to help women orgasm. So we'll continue this on after the break. 2.15 on BBC One today. Thank you very um, much. Uh, welcome you. back. Thank you. Yeah, it's <laughs> lovely to have you back. Thank you. <laughs> Good luck with the campaign this thank week. You. Right, that's it for today. Tomorrow, Paul Potts and Charlotte Church is going to be here. Have a good day. We'll see you tomorrow at 